Pretty. This is Erin. And this is Josh. And today we're showcasing three different emergency radios. Um, I think we're going to go ahead and start here with uh, Intipal. I believe I'm saying that correct. Intipal sent us um, this radio and they also sent an emergency blanket with it, which was cool. I love it when companies send, you know, a little free gift with their item. Anyway, this particular radio has a solar panel on top. Underneath the solar panel, there is an LED. Oh, look, it's still holding the charge. Nice. Yeah, we put all these outside in the sun for the same period of time to see um, how long they would hold a charge and if they would hold a charge. Um, anyway, there's also a flashlight. Why is it not working? Oh, there. <laughs> I swear these videos operator error for me all the time. We have an antenna here on the side. No copyright. Ooh. Okay, anyway, the point is this radio works really well. It holds a charge, and you can also charge. So, USB. Mm -hmm. And what's that other one? Micro? Uh, micro USB. So, it's got a USB and micro USB here on the side. Um, there is a compartment for batteries here, three AAA batteries, or the hand crank. Pretty cool. It's lightweight. I like it. Oh, one more thing. It's got an SOS option. It's really loud. Um, with a flashing light, I'm not turning it on again to show you. If you didn't see it, you didn't see it, but there's a red dot here that flashes, flashes, flashes during that. So this has multiple features. There are three ways to um, charge or, is that how you word it? Or hold a battery? Okay, so there's three different ways to power this particular radio. And um, I think this is great. So Intipal, thank you so much for sending this for us to showcase. I definitely, think this would be a good one to have in uh, my bug out bag. Josh is going to go ahead and showcase two radios that came from Compass Culture Brand. So this radio looks very similar to the first radio, which I believe it is the same radio, just different color and a different name on it. Um, all the same features, the hand crank, the solar with the light, the flashlight, the actual radio. Oh, I need to tune it in. Weather band. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys about that. This one as well has the weather band. Sorry. Oh, sounds like it's gonna be lovely. So there is, to me, there's no difference between the radios besides the name on it. Um, still 100% enjoy this one. I can latch it to anything I want to. It also has a strap that's adjustable for your hand, so you could keep it in your hands. And um, same option with the solar panel, battery operated. It's pretty good. Um, these, these ones came with a paracord bracelet with a fire starter, a compass, and a whistle. Fantastic. So now we'll go to a little bigger version. So this was sent to us by the same company. It's got a couple flip up option for the light in the back. And it's basically the same thing, just in a bigger version. Let's see how it sounds. Okay. Um, I have no power. So Compass Culture Brand sent two radios. One is pretty much identical to the first one we showcased from Intipal. This one, I don't think, something must be wrong because it's not holding a charge. Can you see the red light as he's whining? You can hear the radio trying. 
but it won't hold the charge. So it seems like it only works if you're cranking it, which can't be right. We had these out in the sun all for the same amount of time, so. Nope, Nothing. it won't hold a charge. There's something defective about this one. That happens sometimes. It's mm. important to test your items. If you do order something for your kit, bug out bag or anything like that, it's important to test your items and make sure that you know they work or they're gonna work for you. That's too bad. That's really too bad. I'm, I'm, I'm really disappointed. This one, it won't hold a charge, period. Let's see if it'll charge. Oh, great idea. We use one radio to charge another. I was really wanting to show you guys this because it's basically the same thing, but a little bit different with the light bar. Um, whereas this one where the solar bar is, when you lift it up, it's got an LED that brightens up the whole room. It works with it uh, being charged, but... So as long as it's plugged into something or has batteries in it, this will work, but it's constant drain. It, it doesn't hold... Hmm. It doesn't hold a charge. That's got to be a defect. I can't imagine can't imagine the company selling a product like that. So we must have just gotten a defective one. It looks really cool, though. I like the boombox look. Yeah. And plus, you get the option to turn light on and off if you want to. Whereas this one, yeah. It's pretty bright. This one, it just it's on if that's up. But The nice thing about this, though, the um, two that are basically the same radio. Um, so depending on the angle of the sun, obviously you could turn this. Mm. And as long as it's just open a little bit, the LED light doesn't come on so it would continue charging. I like these. Nice. I like these little ones. I thought I was gonna like the big one. Well, I'd probably like the big one if it worked. <laughs> yeah, short video for you guys today. We just, like Jessica said, real quickly wanted to give you guys a, an idea of some of the things that are being offered out there right now on Amazon through the marketplace. Yeah, check out our description and maybe look into one of these for your kit or your family. These would be great to have on hand for camping. And Definitely. camping season's just around the corner. Well, thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay safe, take care. Bye-bye. I'm missing you.